Hey guys, Baizu here, and welcome to the first ever Pokemon Sun and Moon Wi-Fi battle on the channel. We are going up against Daniki, aka Dan Lad, aka Dan the Man. He is going to be our first opponent for our Sun and Moon Wi-Fi battles, and I'm excited and ready to go. We've already gotten some VGC going up on here, so now it's time to get back into the singles. The meta is completely, really unknown right now. Camera, fo focus, right here. Focus. Focus. There you go. Uh, the camera, or the camera, the meta is completely unknown right now. Obviously, it's just Gen 7 meta right now since Pokebank uh, Nintendo just stupidly didn't make it available at launch. So, I'm going to go Gen 7. This is the team we're bringing up against Dan. Bringing our Choice Scarf Bruxis, Assault Fest to Hail Mize, Life Orb with the Swords Dancing um, at Lycanroc. We are bringing our Stealth Rocker and the Heal Glow. We are bringing our Choice Banded, Incineroar, and our Choice Specs, Magirna. So this is the team that we're going to be going up against with Dan. I don't know what the heck Dan is bringing, but uh, this is kind of just a team. I'm like, you know what, let's, uh, let's, I like these are the mods that I kind of like, so I'm like, all right, let's make a team around it and see how it works. Um, don't know exactly how this team, I don't know, it has some decent comp, or decent, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Comp, composition to each other. Um, so he's bringing, oh, he's bringing this team, the comfy team that he brought, uh, against Jack, I believe. Yeah, so that's, that's fun. Um, so he's got comfy, Tapu Fini, uh, Minior, a Marowak, uh, Lycanroc, and, um, totally forgot what the name of that thing is, but it's the black crystal prism thingy, Maduhicker, Nick, Nicolomaplasm, or something like that. Um, so, who do we want to lead off with? Um, obviously he has his Tapu Fini as a way to get rid of- Actually, I kind of want to lead with maybe Magirna? Possibly, because he has no- No, uh, immunities to Volt Switch, so I think I'm going to lead with Magirna. And, um, before I hit this last one, let me write down his team, because that would be actually helpful. Because Comfy- Tapu Fini, uh, Minior, Marowak, Lycanroc, and I don't know your name, so Black Crystal Thing. Alright, <laughs> let's go ahead and go up and in here, and we're going to hit confirm, and uh, that's what we're going to do. So let's see what uh, Dan's got going up in here. Um, we don't have... We don't have any, like I said, in the VGC, we don't have any of the fancy schmancy battle tree poses because I haven't had the desire or care to do <laughs> battle tree to get them because I believe that's where you get them. I don't, I don't even freaking know, but uh, that's where we're going to go. So he's going to lead off with his Tapu Fini, predicting me to possibly lead off with either my Lycanroc or um, my thing that I can actually set up. South Rocks with that is completely blanking from my mind right now. Hello? What's my Stealth Rocker? Um, <laughs> the Heal Glue. Thank you. Uh, Alright, so we've got Magirna up in here. Um, I think I'm just going to go for a Volt Switch. I think I'm just going to go for a Volt Switch. And uh, communication with the other trainer has been interrupted, so that's fun. Uh, <laughs> we'll be right back. Alrighty, we're gonna try this again. So luckily it just DC'd um, on the very first start. So we're doing the same leads that we started off with originally, and I'm gonna just click Volt Switch, like I said again. Um, so hopefully we don't have another DC. Apparently um, Jack was also saying that there, he was having some issues with the internet disconnecting and whatnot, even though when we disconnected, both me and Dan were still online to the Festival Plaza. Um, so it's on Nintendo's side that's being really silly. But anyway, um, I mean, the Festival Plaza is just straight cancer. It's really not good at all. Um, I really miss the PSS system that they had. I don't know why they got rid of it. They had a little silliness, but whatever. So we're going to just Volt Switch. Um, and see what's going to happen from there. Hopefully we don't have any more issues or anything like that. Um, we don't have any more issues like that. 
Oh, he's going to Calm Mind. Okay. That's fun. Do a decent chunk of damage. I, had I gone for the Fleural Cannon, I think that uh, we would have been... Do a huge chunk of damage. Um, what do I want to go into? I can go into Dutchman. I'm going to Dutchman. Um, I do have the Assault Vest. Go for a Power Whip. Possibly. Hmm. I mean, I already got. I did a good chunk of damage here. I just want. I need to go into something that can take. I mean, Dem Lips can. Uh... Let's go into Dem Lips. Let's go into Dem Lips, and we'll head off with the Psychic. Psychic thing, because I think the black crystal thing, I don't think it's dark, I think it's just pure psychic. Could be mistaken. Like I said, I'm not entire I'm not, you know, fully fully up to date on all the everything that regards to uh Um the Wi-Fi battlings and whatnot. So let's see. Uh we're just gonna go ahead and hit him with the psychic fangs. Nice uh strong jaw psychic fangs. See what uh see how much that's gonna do. That's gonna be a two hit chaos, that's pretty good. Uh, he's gonna get a moon blast off, which is not going to be able to take. Oh no, we got a special attack drop on my physical attacker. Oh no, that's terrible. That's horrible news. That's horrible. All right, we're just gonna go for another second fangs. Um, and yeah, because I don't really, honestly, need need this thing. Um, I don't really. So, psychic fangs will do a decent chunk. To something that he wants to switch in, or he can just let this thing go down. Pretty much are the choices here for Dan. Who would he switch into? I guess he would switch into his physical wall, which would be, I don't know, something. But no, he's just gonna let this thing go down. Um, so Tapu Fini goes down, that's good, because that was a pretty big threat in terms of uh, whatchamacallit's. Um, Okay, so he goes into this thing. So I'm assuming he, has, he thinks that I'm scarfed. I, I I honestly I need to look this thing up. I don't I don't. Neck necrozma. That's the same. So it is pure psychic. Uh, decently slow. Okay. So it is pure psychic. Who do I want to go into? Cause I mean I can go to does this thing learn? Uh, let me see here. Does this thing learn? Oh, come on! <sighs> oh, I... I hate... Fuck. In Christ. Alrighty, we're trying this again. We've, moved, we've done the same exact steps as we did last time, so this is the point where the DC happens, so hopefully it doesn't happen again. So we're gonna switch out into Dutchman. Because um, it's assault vested, so I'm pretty sure we can take hopefully a hit from this thing. I don't honestly, I don't remember. I mean, I watched Jack's side of the match. I don't know if Dan even recorded the side of the match, but uh, um, watched Jack's side of the match. So I don't, I don't know what items Dan has. I don't even actually. I don't fully remember. Anyway, we're gonna just shout claw, I guess. Uh, he's gonna go for a charge beam. We're assault vested. Max HP, yeah, we, we eat that up. We eat that up. And luckily, he did not get the special attack raise. So that's good. I think the Shadow Claw, which is going to take out the sub of the E Plaza, E, e Hero thingy. I'm going to do Higgy. Um, Alright, we're going to just go for another. Yeah, there's no reason to not go for another Shadow Claw. Oh, he's going for. He's going for his Z move. Um, I don't know what Z move it is. Z what? Z Shattered Psych, which is I'm assuming a psychic type move. But I mean that's resisted. Plus I'm uh assault vested. So yeah, oh wow. Okay, it wasn't resisted. What the heck was that? I don't know what Shadowed Psych is then. And this thing is bulky, because I think I'm, 
Am I not max adamant? Pretty sure I am. It doesn't show me in this. That's... Oh, it doesn't do the colors? I thought it did in Oras the colors, didn't it? Alright, well. I'm not entirely sure what... What that was. Um... Alright, well, we'll just go for a Shadow Claw again. Uh, he's gonna go for a Psychic, which is... Going to take us out! I thought there was probably... There's a chance that, uh... I could've lived that... Oh! The reason why he lived is because he has the, uh... The armor thing. Um... So I think I just go into Dim Lips, and I can go for Waterfalls. I can go for Waterfall. Um, yeah, I'm just going to go for a waterfall. We'll just go for a waterfall. Unfortunately, the Flying Dutchman does go down. Um, but this E-Hero Prisma is going to go down as well, so that's good. So that's... His two legendaries are down, so that's... That's good. Those are huge threats. Um, Alright, so he sends out Kira, which is... The Lycan Rock, um, so you can go for an Excel Rock, obviously. Um, yeah. So with that in mind, I think I'm just gonna go for I'm just gonna go for Waterfall again, um, just so that way. Oh, he that way he doesn't get off any Swords Dances or anything like that. No swords dances and whatnot for that guy. Oh, he went for a fire fang. He's actually going for a prediction. He was going for a prediction. All right, predicting me to switch into Magirna or something, I suppose. Uh, we'll just go for another waterfall. Or maybe he didn't know that I. Or no, he went for fire fang. <laughs> I was gonna say maybe he didn't know that I was uh, wasn't uh, try scarf. But no, yeah, he went for fire fang, predicting me to switch because he was predicting me to predict the Excel Rock. But I didn't want to actually him to set up any swords dances or anything like that. And I honestly did not remember that he was, uh... He was, um... What's the word I'm looking for? He was not, uh... So I'm just, I'm just going to make gear and I think... I can go to my own guru room on. Go for speed ties and whatnot. Um, uh, I need to go room on for um, Minior. Minior can take a hit, but I don't really want him to. Uh, yeah, I'm just I'm gonna go into my own guru room on. I'm gonna go into my own guru room on. Oh, he just he just sent me a thing on uh, on uh, on Skype. He thought I was the dazzling or whatever, which prevents uh, prevents um, what calls it prevents um, priority moves. Um, so I just wanted. To, okay, so that's smart. That's why he didn't go for Excel Rock. That makes sense, because he was assuming that I was dazzling. But no, I'm strong jaws for the psychic fangs and crunch and whatnot. Um, so, I guess that I guess that kind of bluff worked then. Uh, I don't know then why he would go... I don't know. Uh, he's going to go into Comfy. That's interesting. Um, I think I'm going to set up a swords dance. His Lycan Rock is down, so he's got Minior, Marowak, and Comfy. Yep, so he set up a Swords Dance as he sets up the Minding of the Calm variety. Um, so now I have to go for Stone Edge and hope it doesn't miss. Come on, Guru Ruman. Come on, Guru Ruman, you've got you've got your spectacles on. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. 
You've got this. You've got this. Dan's thinking. Dan's thinking what he wants to do now. Uh, come on. Come on. What are you gonna do, Dan? Uh, uh, um, hurry, Dan, before we DC again. <laughs> Come on, Stone Mist, please. Please. I'm begging you. We go for the graining kiss. I guess, oh, it's speed tied. Oh, interesting, we speed tied. Okay. Welp, that sucks incredibly. Oh, does does triage work on draining kiss? Oh, that's stupid. Uh. Okay, and then he won the speed tie again, so he won two speed ties. That's fun. That's fun. All right. Uh, well, I'm I'm gonna go into Magirna. Ah, oh, that's lame sauce. Um, I old flash cannon. That really sucks. That that stone edge missed because I could have probably actually swept. I would have. I could have. Yeah, I would have definitely been able to sweep because you just had the Marowak and the Minior left. So that's oh, that sucks so bad. Oh man, that sucks. And he won two speed ties, or he won. He actually, he ran one one speed tie against. Because I outsped him when he went for calm mind, didn't I? Didn't I? Yeah, I went for swords dance, and he went for calm mind. So I outsped him there. So we either speed tied. Or wait, what? Hmm. I don't remember. I don't remember. Uh, but let's see. That's going to say goodbye, Comfy. <laughs> uh, that plus two, that plus two, uh, defense, that don't mean shit to a modest choice of X, Magirna. Uh, Alright, so he's got Minior and uh, Marowak left, obviously. Um, so I'm pretty sure I kind of need to keep what I have. Ah. Uh, Yeah, I kind of keep me, uh, Magirna for that Minior. So I think I'm going to go into Blue Jelly. Yeah, I'm going to go into Blue Jelly. Um, just because, why the heck not? Because we have, we have the, uh, whatchamacallit. We have, um, our... Wow, our in, our uh, Insinio or our the Thug Life over here to uh, to do some things and stuff. So Blue Jelly was able to eat up that Flare Blitz quite nicely. Um, so do I want to get the late game Stealth Rocks up, or do I just go for a Power Gem? Um, I'm just gonna go for Power Gems. Well, like, do I get the late the late game Stealth Rocks up? Nah, I'm just gonna go for a Power Gem. Um, Gad, Shields Down is going to activate. Um, some power jam off. I know, oh, it gets Earthquake. Oh, oh, oh dear. That, that was a crit. I don't know if that crit mattered. I didn't know how. I didn't think I was going to do that much damage. Holy crap. Okay. <laughs> um, well then, I guess that's, uh. That was, uh, that was, uh, interesting. I don't know if that crit really mattered. Um, I mean, he would have, obviously, if he had he no. I mean, he would have earthquaked, but he would have been in, I don't know. I don't know. Um, 
Not to, I outspeed the Marowak. That's interesting. And then there goes Marowak. So that is the game right there. Um, so I don't. I honestly don't know if that crit mattered. It may or may not have because I don't, I don't know. I don't have any special attack investment in uh, our blue jelly. So, but that was a good game. Very good game. Make sure uh, Dan's link to his channel, will of course, be in the description down below. So make sure you go and check out his battle, um, or go check out his channel. I have no idea if he recorded this or if he's going to post comment. Probably not because it was a 3-0. But um, anyway, uh, Dan is a great guy. So make sure you subscribe to his channel if you haven't done so already. He's trying to hit 1,000 before the uh, new year. So maybe you guys can help him do that. So I hope you guys enjoyed for the very first Pokemon Sun and Moon Wi-Fi battle on the channel. And I guess I'll see you guys later.